Well, hello there! It's that time again. Yes, it is. It is time for our weekly tarot and astrology reading here on this lovely Sunday evening of June the 26th of 2022. As usual, I am going to go over some Tarot de Marse trump cards that I drew at random for upcoming week. That's going to be followed by some astrology, which will be particularly interesting. So please stay tuned. Okay, in a moment, three Tarot de Marse trump cards are going to come onto the screen and cover my face. The cards I drew at random from the CBD Tarot are the World, the Empress, and the Priestess. Now, I find this particularly interesting and powerful. But one thing, the World card has a wreath around her. It's like she's protected. She's shielded. She's looking towards the left, which we could be presuming to be the direction of the past, but she's isolating herself from it, as well as having the four Caribbean animals around her. And then we see in the next frame that we have the Empress, who has her shield under her right arm, as if she's kind of blocking out this energy from the past, or perhaps she's assimilating it. It's all assimilated, it's all under control, under her belt, so to speak, and now she can rule with her scepter of power. And as she is doing this, she is getting new information. Yes, the priestess is offering the book to her. She's saying, here, here's to guide you. Here's to help you with your future decisions. Because you've dealt with the past. You've resolved some issues. You've taken care of some things. doesn't have to influence you. Now there's new influences that can come in. New information that can guide you and help you along your way. So that's what we can expect for this week. We can expect that we're going to resolve some issues, have them under control, and then have new information coming in that's going to be helpful to us, and this dovetails well with the astrology. Yes, this week we're going to have a new moon, new energy coming in on the 28th. Two days from now, Tuesday, we'll have moon in Cancer. We also have sun in Cancer. It's a lot of water energy. Okay, there might be a lot of sensitivity in the air, uh, but that's how it is. So we're going to have that new moon, new beginnings, new power, new energies, new knowledge, ability to manifest, ability to make things come in, abundance, health, wealth, you name it. Whatever you're looking for, whatever you need, this next two weeks will be the time to manifest it, the time to make it happen. Next Sunday, we are going to have the moon in good aspect with the sun. So that will be a good day for working with the solar energy for uh, bringing in success, working with authority, you know, influencing people that can help us to bring about our goals into fruition. So this can actually be a very, very powerful week. Uh, we do have the uh, planet Saturn in Aquarius still. Uh, sign of rulership in the old astrology. We have Mars in the signs of and the sign of Aries. We have Mercury in the sign of Gemini. These are signs these planets rule. So Mercury, Mars, Saturn are particularly strong at this time. Our personal power with Mars, ability to defend Saturn, which is structure and responsibility, and Mercury, which is our thinking, and also our ability to communicate and do magic. So there you go, some good news, some good stuff. I love you, I appreciate you. Thanks for tuning in to our weekly tarot and astrology reading. Till I see you next week, many, many blessings.